The Garial. The Garial, also known as the Gavial or the fish-eating crocodile, is a crocodilian in the family Gavialidae and among the longest of all living crocodilians. Mature females are 2.6 to 4.5 meters long, and males 3 to 6 meters. They have a distinct boss at the end of the snout, which resembles an earthenware pot known as agara, hence the name, garial. The garial is well adapted to catching fish because of its long, thin snout and 110 sharp, interlocking teeth. The garial probably evolved in the northern Indian subcontinent. Fossil garial remains were excavated in Pliocene deposits in the Savalik Hills and the Narmada River Valley. It currently inhabits rivers in the plains of the northern part of the Indian subcontinent. It is the most thoroughly aquatic crocodilian, and leaves the water only for basking and building nests on moist sandbanks. Adults mate at the end of the cold season. Females congregate in spring to dig nests. They lay 20 to 95 eggs, and guard the nests and the young that hatch before the onset of the monsoon. The hatchlings stay and forage in shallow water during their first year, but move to sites with deeper water as they grow. The wild garial population has declined drastically since the 1930s, and is limited to only 2% of its historical range today. Conservation programs initiated in India and Nepal focused on reintroducing captive bred garials since the early 1980s. Loss of habitat because of sand mining and conversion to agriculture, depletion of fish resources and detrimental fishing methods continue to threaten the population. It has been listed as critically endangered on the IUCN Red List since 2007. Characteristics The garial is olive-colored, with adults being darker than young, which have dark brown crossbands and speckles. Its back turns almost black at 20 years of age, but its belly is yellowish-white. It has four transverse rows of two scales on the neck, which continue along the back. Scoots on the head, neck and back form a single continuous plate composed of 21 to 22 transverse series, and four longitudinal series. Scoots on the back are bony, but softer and feebly killed on the sides. The outer edges of the forearms, legs, and feet have crests jutting out, fingers and toes are partly webbed. Its snout is very long and narrow, widened at the end, and with 27 to 29 upper teeth and 25 or 26 lower teeth on each side. The front teeth are the largest. The first, second, and third lower jaw teeth fit into spaces in the upper jaw. The extremely long mandibular symphysis extends to the 23rd or 24th tooth. The snout of adult garials is 3.5 times longer than the width of the skull's base. Because of this long snout the garial is especially adapted to catching and eating fish. The nasal bones are rather short and widely spaced from the premaxillae. The jugal bone is raised. It becomes proportionally thicker with age. The garial has a bite force of 1,784 to 2,006 n. Male garials develop a hollow bulbous nasal protuberance at the tip of the snout upon reaching sexual maturity. This protuberance resembles an earthen pot known locally as gara. The male's gara starts growing over the nostrils at an age of 11.5 years and measures about 5 cm x 6 cm x 3.5 cm at an age of 15.5 years. It enables the males to emit a hissing sound that can be heard 75 meters away. The garial is the only living crocodilian with such visible sexual dimorphism. Female garials reach sexual maturity at a body length of 2.6 meters and grow up to 4.5 meters. Males mature at a body length of at least 3 meters and grow up to a length of 6 meters. Adult males weigh about 160 kilograms on average. Mature male garials have larger skulls than females, exceeding a basal length of 715 mm and a width of 287 mm. A 6.55 m long garial was killed in the Gahara River in Faizabad in August 1920. Male garials with an alleged length of 7.16 to 9.14 m were sighted around the turn of the 20th century in Indian rivers. Thanks for watching.